Can't keep anything Say. to himself. Hey, you're one of us. Let me tell you something. If you intend to empty some pockets in town, be especially careful with the merchants. They're pretty sharp at watching their stuff, but I can give you a tip. Try to grab the desired object with one hand and wave about with the other. That distracts them. Show me your wares. If I hadn't times. seen it with my own eyes. That's, That's not what my husband always said. Honestly, he can't I keep anything to himself. And, and he say. works all day, too. I, I can't say. take care of everything for everybody. Who everybody says things knows by now? Go really? Away. Don't I tell understand. me that. He'd better shut up. Who says things Don't like that? Me. That's Who not what my husband like does. That? He can't keep anything to himself. I took care of the bandits. Really? Anyone could say that. Do you have proof? <sighs> Should I go back and cut off their heads? No. I don't think that will be necessary. I believe you. You have done the merchants and the city a great service. Here is the money you have promised. I've got to go. Suit yourself. Really, how interesting. That's an open secret. I don't believe it. It's no secret. I agree with you completely. He thinks it's as easy as that. Don't tell me you didn't know that. He really should have known better. I'm not telling you anything new. That will never change.
Stop right there, you lowlife! You're in for it now. Ah! Stop! Yes! Run as fast as you can! Nothing to be had there. Nothing to plunder. How much money do you need for the contest? Ten gold coins. I'll give you the money to compete against Rukar. Really? Thank you so much. I'll repay you soon. If I win, I'll even fork out a little more than that. I'll be seeing you. About those stone tablets, I've got some. Thank you. That's enough. Now I could keep my promise to the water mage in town and then go home at last. I'll pay you for them, of course. I'm going home now. Come with me if you like. Maybe I can sell you a few things that might interest you when we get there. Put that weapon away!
That was a fine mess you got me into. Now I can play lookout for Rookar again. Why? As long as he's holding his little contest in there, it's better if no outsider learns about it. It's not good for business, you see. What kind of armor can you offer me? I have here a very nice piece that is sure to please you. I'll think about it. As you like, but don't wait too long. Traveling so far from home, out here you have to be careful, especially when you're all by yourself. What are you doing out here? Well, the tavern is too expensive for me. That's why I settled here. The previous inhabitants don't seem to need it anymore. Who used to live in this camp? No idea. Probably some hunters. I suppose it got too dangerous for them out here. Isn't it too dangerous out here? Well, not if you can defend yourself. My crossbow has already proven to be of service many times. It's not all that big. But deadly, if you know how to handle it. I used to have a bigger one. Unfortunately, I lost it. I ventured too far north into the mountains. There's a big stone circle there with a sacrificial altar. While I was hunting scavengers up there, these vile undead beings came out of the woods and attacked me. All I could do was run for my life. While I was running, the crossbow slipped from my hand. I bet it's still lying up there by that strange stone circle in the north. Can you teach me something? Before I teach you anything, you'll have to improve your dexterity.
This here is your hut? Yes. Why? Anything wrong with it? Don't you have any problems with the mercenaries? Eh, uh, as long as I don't interfere with their business, they'll leave me alone too. Moreover, they're good customers, and I pay them to keep an eye on my house when I'm not home. Show me how I can hit harder. Right. Pay attention. There's a simple trick. When you hit, you don't take strength from your arm, but from your entire body. Turn your hip, bring your shoulder to the front, and stretch out your arm at the same time. <laughs> if you hit right, you'll notice the difference. Show me your wares. There isn't much choice, I'm afraid. Things would have turned out differently if it hadn't been for us.